Barbush Enterprises with James Eugene Barbush, founder of Harrisburg Biz Leaders, brings you an HBL leadership tip. Listen and catch your wave. Today's tip is about survival sayings. I have a few survival sayings. One of my survival sayings that I came up with a couple of years ago is life stops for no one. What's that mean, life stops for no one? That means whatever's going on in your life, it's coming at you. Trials, tribulations, challenges, it's coming at you. Just like these three trains coming down the track. Trains coming at you. Challenges. And I picked these steam locomotives because as a child and raised in the 1950s, I used to live near the railroad tracks. And in my house, I could hear the whistle blow. And I knew at the age of five that the train was a coming. So I'd run out of my house run a half block down the sidewalk and stand on the bridge and watch for that train to come puffing its smoke it's gray and black smoke and i stood there on the bridge as the locomotive went underneath and i just stood in the smoke and the soot and watched those trains go by so comparatively speaking we have challenges in our lives trains are coming at us trains challenges, tribulations, difficulties, things within ourselves, struggles within ourselves, struggles with relationships, things that we debate in our mind. Should we? Should we not? How are we going to handle those things? Struggles at home life, which could be finances, which could be home maintenance. Now there's a big one, home maintenance. Could be relationships. Could be teenagers. Aha, many of you know that one, teenagers. Or it might be the hopefully retired empty nesters. Well, they're not empty nesters. Their chickens have come home to roost again. And then work. When you cross the threshold from home life to work life, it's a whole different dynamic, a whole different set of challenges. How do you face those challenges? Budgetary challenges, schedule challenges. So no matter what it is, whether it's yourself personally, whether it's your home life or your work life, how are you facing those challenges? And here's one, the challenge of politics. The elephants and the donkeys. Who's right? Whose ways should be best to lead the country? Politicians. Oh, they give us a lot of challenges. Taxes, we are challenged. Laws, rules, regulations, environmental requirements. Challenge after challenge for us to meet. Life stops for no one. What haven't I mentioned? What specific challenge are you going through right now where that is not stopping for you because life stops for no one? And a survival saying like this can help me because it equalizes us. It tells me that I am no different than anyone else. Though I may think I have huge challenges like no one else has, the reality is there's a lot of people that have the similar challenges that I do with themselves, with their home life, with their work life, with their politics, and with a lot of other things. So life stops where no one. We are all on this train or standing in front of this train in a sense together. The trains are coming at us. How are you going to handle the issues? Life stops for no one. That one phrase can help bolster you in pressing on through and in finding a solution or solutions to those challenges. So remember, when you're facing those things, in yourself, in your home, in your work, in your politics. Life stops for no one. It's an equalizer. And that's an HBL leadership tip from Barbush Enterprises with James Eugene Barbush, founder of Harrisburg Biz Leaders.
You've heard. Now use it. Catch your wave. Because life stops for no one.